start with a chain of three as the first double crochet. In the next two stitches, one double crochet. So this is actually number two and number three following. Chain three. In the following three stitches, again, one double crochet in each stitch. So three double crochets in a row. This is number two and number three. Chain three. In the first stitch, you make two double crochet. This is number. Oh, sorry. This is number one and number two in the same stitch. And one double crochet in the next stitch. One double crochet in the next stitch. So here it is. Now chain two. Skip one stitch. And in the following stitch, one double crochet. And in the next stitch, two double crochets. This is number one. And number two. Now, chain three. One, two, three. In the next three stitches, each one double crochet. So, this is number one. Number two and number three. Now we skip the chain and we go up to the next three stitches, and there you make one double crochet in each stitch. So you skip the chain from the previous row. Now chain three. In the first stitch, again, two double crochets. So this is number one and number two. In the next stitch, one double crochet, chain two, skip a stitch, and in the next stitch, one double crochet, and in the following stitch, two double crochets. This is number one and number two in the same stitch. Now, chain three, one, two, three. In the following three stitches, you make one double crochet in each stitch. So, this is number one. Number two and number three, chain three. Now you go to the next three stitches and again one double crochet in each stitch. So this is number one, number two and number three. So three double crochets in a row again. Now chain five, three, four, and now we start the repeating part let's see from here all the way over till here this will be the repeating part so we go into the next three stitches you skip the last leaf shape and you go to the next three stitches and you make one double crochet in each stitch so it's number one it's number two and number three. Now chain three. This is number three. In the next three stitches again, each one double crochet. This is number one, number two, and number three. Chain three. In the next stitch, you make two double crochets. So this is number one and number two. In the next stitch, you make one double crochet, chain two, skip a stitch, in the next stitch, one double crochet, and in the following stitch, two double crochets. Number one and number two in the same stitch. Sorry. So, now chain three. Go to the next three stitches and you make in each stitch one double crochet. So it's number one. This is number two. Sorry. And number three. Now we skip the chain from the previous row and we go direct to the next three stitches. And there you make again one double crochet in each stitch. 
So there should be six double crochets in a row without a chain space in between them. So here it is. Now chain three. In the first stitch, two double crochet in one stitch. So this is number one and number two. I stuck. Here it is. Number two. In the next stitch, one double crochet. Now chain two. Skip a stitch, and in the next stitch, you make one double crochet. And in the following stitch, you make two double crochets. This is number one and number two. Chain three. In the next three stitches, you make one double crochet in each stitch. So this is number one, this is number two, and number three. Here it is, chain three. In the next three stitches, you make one double crochet in each stitch. So again, three double crochets in a row. This is number two and number three. And now chain five, two, three, four, and number five. So now the repeating part will be from here all the way over up until the last chain five. Repeat this throughout this round and we'll close this row together and start the next round. I crocheted around and made my last chain five. And We'll slip stitch into the third stitch we started with here and we'll start the next round. So here we start off again with a chain three. One, two, three. In the next two, two stitches, you make one double crochet in each stitch. One and number two. Now chain three. In the next three stitches, you make one double crochet in each stitch. So it's number one, number two, and number three. Chain three. In the next three stitches, you make each stitch one double crochet. It's so number one, number two, and number three. Sorry. Now chain four, one, two, three, four. Skip to the next three stitches and you make one double crochet on top of them. So three double crochets in a row. It's number one, it's number two, and number three. Chain three. Now we start with two double crochets together. So in the first two stitches. There's the first unfinished double crochet and in the next stitch an unfinished double crochet. Three loops on the hook, yarn around and pull through. Over the next two stitches you make one double crochet, so it's number one and number two. And the following two stitches you make two double crochet together. So it's the first unfinished double crochet and the second unfinished double crochet makes three loops on the hook yarn around and pull through chain three now skip to the next three stitches and you make one double crochet in each stitch this is number one number two and number three chain four one two three four Go to the next three stitches and you make one double crochet in each stitch. This is number one, number two, and number three. Chain three. Go to the next three stitches and again one double crochet in each stitch. This is number one, number two, and number three. Chain three. In the next three stitches again one double crochet in each stitch so this is number one number two number three chain three 
And this is from here all the way over here the repeating part. So let's get started. In the first three stitches, each one double crochet. So this is number one. So this will be the repeating part from now on. This is number two and number three. Chain three. One, two, three. In the next three stitches you make each one double crochet. Now you start seeing that the edge of this uh, doily will curl up. That is okay because we need to shape the it into a handbag later on. So that's okay. Now chain three. In the first three stitches you make each one double crochet. It's number one, number two and number three. Now chain four. Four. Skip to the next three stitches. You make one double crochet in each stitch. It's number one, number two, and number three. Chain three. One, two, three. In the following two stitches, you make two double crochet together. So in the first stitch, one unfinished double crochet, and in the second stitch, one unfinished double crochet. Makes one, two, three loops on the hook, yarn around and pull through. In the next two stitches you make one double crochet in each stitch. This is number one and number two. And the following two stitches you make two double crochet together. So here is the first unfinished double crochet. And the second unfinished double crochet makes one, two, three loops on the hook, yarn around and pull through. Chain three. In the next three stitches you make each one double crochet. So this is the first, the second and third double crochet in a row. Chain four. One, two, three, four. Go to the next three stitches and again one double crochet in each stitch. This is number one, number two and number three. Chain three, one, two, three. In the next three stitches again, one double crochet in each stitch. It's number one. And number two and number three. Chain three, one, two, three. In the next three stitches, each stitch one double crochet. So this is number one. Number two and number three, chain three. So now you start repeating from here all the way over up to the last chain three throughout this round and we'll finish this round together. I crocheted around and made my last chain three and we slip stitch into the third chain we started with. One, two, three, here it is. Slip stitch. Now chain three as the first double crochet. In the next two stitches, one double crochet in each stitch. So this is number one and number two makes three included chain three. Chain three. In the next three stitches again, one double crochet in each stitch. One, number two, and number three. Chain three. In the following three stitches, one double crochet in each stitch. This is number one, number two, and number three. Now, chain three. One double crochet in the chain four from the previous row. Chain three. One, two, three. In the next three stitches again, one double crochet in each stitch. So that's the first, the second, and third double crochet in a row. Chain three. Now, over the first and the second you make two double crochets together. So I hope you can see it clearly enough here. 
So in the first stitch you make one unfinished double crochet. And in the second stitch one unfinished double crochet makes one, three loops on hook and pull through. And over the next two stitches again two double crochets together. So the first unfinished double crochet and the second unfinished double crochet. And pull through the three loops. Chain three. Skip to the next three stitches. And make one double crochet in each stitch. The first, the second, and third double crochet in a row. Here it is. Chain 3. One double crochet around chain 4 from the previous row. Chain 3. And in the next three stitches again, one double crochet in each stitch. This is one, this is the second, and third. Chain 3. One double crochet over the next three stitches. So this is number one, number two, and number three. Chain three. One, two, three. One double crochet in the next three stitches. This is number one, number two, and number three. And that's it for this repeating part. So from now on we're doing a repeating part from here all the way over till here and we don't crochet a chain three right now so we skip directly to the next chain three uh, to the next three stitches and make one double crochet in each stitch so you end up with six double crochets in a row in this area now chain three in the next three stitches again one double crochet in each stitch one this is number two and number three chain three one double in the next three stitches so this is number one number two and number three chain three Three double crochet, uh, one double crochet around the chain four from the previous row. Sorry, chain three. One double crochet over the next three stitches. So this is the first, the second, and third. Chain three. Two double crochet together, so it's the first unfinished double crochet, and in the next second unfinished double crochet, three loops on the hook and pull through, and again two double crochets together. So it's the first unfinished double crochet and the second unfinished double crochet and pull through. Chain three. Go to the next three stitches and one double crochet in each stitch. This is number one, number two. And number three. Chain three. One double crochet in a chain four from the previous row. Chain three. One double crochet on top of the next three double crochets from the previous row. So this is number one, number two, and number three. And chain three. One, two, three. One double crochet in the next three stitches. It's number one, number two, and number three. Chain three. One double crochet in the next three stitches. It's number one, number two, and number three. So the repeating part will be from here all the way up until the last double crochet repeat this throughout this round and we'll finish this row together i crochet around and slip stitch into the third chain we started with and then we continue in part four hope to see you there <laughs> 